Hello everyone, today in this video we will see how you can set up USPS API 3 integration using LX USPS shipping plugin. So let's understand what is USPS API 3. The USPS API 3 and USPS EVS are two different systems offered by the USPS for handling shipping and logistics. USPS API 3 refers to the suite of APIs provided by USPS for various shipping-related functionalities. Unlike EVS, API 3 integration does not have any predefined criteria. So if you do not have approval to generate labels in EVS integration, then you can easily use USPS API 3. As you can see on your screen, you need some credentials in order to use API 3 integration. Now let's quickly understand how you can get these credentials. First go to developer.usps.com slash getting started or follow the link provided in the description. As per this document, follow the steps to set up your USPS developer account and generate your client ID and client secret. You can also directly connect with the USPS team for your credentials. The email ID is displayed on your screen. Once you have the credentials, then go to the settings page of LX USPS shipping plugin on your WooCommerce site. Please note that in this video we will be talking about the settings which are exclusive to USPS API 3. If you need the complete setup guide, then follow the link provided in the description. In the settings page, select the API mode as USPS API 3, then enter your client ID and client secret. Also, fill up other settings like API environment, origin postcode, etc. as per your business requirements. Then save the changes. Next, go to the Label Generation tab and fill up the required field along with the Account Number, CRID, MID, Manifest MID, and ESIT Number. Finally, save changes and go to your cart page and refresh the cart page. As you can see, we are able to get rates. Similarly, if you go to the back end of order page and follow the label generation process as shown on your screen, you will be able to generate the label successfully. Hope you have understood the integration process of USPS API 3. If you need a detailed process, then watch the complete setup guide, and, in case of any further concerns, connect with our support team by following the link provided in the description. That's it for today's video, see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.